Excellency Igor Dreisman, EU's Ambassadors to the Kingdom of Cambodia, Ms. Tobias Person, Executive Director of Sienta and Vinet of Germany, Excellency ladies, gentlemen, and distinguished guests. When it comes to nuclear, an accident anywhere is an accident everywhere. The past incident of nuclear disasters has taught us valuable lessons and has led to a strong consensus within ASEAN on enhanced radiological and nuclear emergency preparedness and response. I'm honored to be here today with Ambassador Igor to launch the German the Gamma Dose Rate Monitoring Stations. True progress is made when we work together, combining resources and expertise to tackle shared challenges like what you just said. On this note, I would like to thank the EU for sharing their considerable experience in the development and use of early warnings radiation monitoring networks and data exchange platforms and for their financial and technical support on this project in Cambodia. I would also like to extend my appreciation to ASEAN TOM, which also facilitates the exchange of nuclear-related knowledge and best practices. A special thank you to Sienta and Vidnet for providing the equipment and that powers our national early warning radiation monitoring network, and to my dedicated colleagues at the Ministry of Mines and Energy and other institutions for their work on advancing this program. The handover and inauguration of this radiation monitoring station is a significant milestone and the culmination of many years of hard work. We recognize that nuclear materials and technology, including ionizing radiation, offer significant benefits but pose substantial risks. These technologies have the potential to benefit humanity in many ways, from medical application to power generations. It also brings with it the challenge of preventing accidents and emergencies. Plant operators, nuclear regulators, and governments must always commit to a safety first approach. It is essential to implement stringent measures to prevent accidents, incidents, and eliminate complacency in nuclear operations at all costs. Although Cambodia has no nuclear power plants and no intention to do one anytime soon for your information, the establishment of this station in Cambodia advances our commitment to nuclear safety, safeguarding our environment, and protecting our citizens from the harmful effects of radiation in case of nuclear accidents or radiological emergency occurring in the region. With the increasing use of nuclear technology and the potential for radiation exposure, we must have the necessary infrastructure in place to monitor and assess radiation levels in our surroundings. The equipment we inaugurate today empowers us with real-time data enabling proactive decision to protect public health and the environment. We continue to pledge to uphold our international obligations and strengthen our safety regime by acceding to the relevant international instruments, including the Convention on Nuclear Safety, the Convention on Early Notification of a Nuclear Accident, and the Convention on Assistance in the Case of a Nuclear Accident or Radiological Emergency, and to reinforce our safety protocols. To further improve our national capabilities in monitoring and assessing radiation levels across our air and marine environments, I extend an invitation to our partners for ongoing collaboration. We welcome support that can help us advance our capabilities and achieve our shared objectives of safeguarding our environment and communities. As we look towards future enhancements, including expansion of our monitoring network and the sustainability of these critical projects, we are open and open to and grateful for the expertise, technical support, and collaboration from our international partners. We must never lose sight of the fact that 
Safety is our priority and collaboration is our strength. Thank you.